Hey guys, and welcome back to... Oh good, we are actually recording. For some reason my stream deck is not... Uh... Not showing me that we're recording. Yes, so, welcome back to Nuclear Strike. When we last uh, left off, we of course were dealing some serious uh, death with our Harrier here. Um... I have struggled recently to get videos up haha, <laughs> on time. Uh, work has been an absolute killer. In fact, I'm out of videos for this game. That's why straight after work today, uh, I am recording this. So this video is going to be fresh off the press. Anyway, let's continue. Um, we did, in the last video, uncover an extra life somewhere, if I remember correctly. And I also remembered another extra life I'm sure we found one around here somewhere there we go right and something else um, actually came back to my memory as well whilst I was at work uh, and that is there's an, a special ammo pickup on Gun Island that I totally forgotten about uh, I think it's only on this level uh, but it gives you a thousand rockets for your helicopter which um, actually also deals massive damage. I'll see, I'll see you in hell. Not unless I see you first, buddy. Uh, I think it's only this level. And I can't actually remember where exactly it was. But I'm sure we are going to find it. Nice. Not bad, boys. Not bad. Right. Oh, hello. Bit of chuggage there. So, ah yes, the this mission. Scuttle attacking LST fleet, Huang Zamada of Troop Transports has launched an attack on Yinbai Island, or Yinbi, um, to the north, attempting to disrupt the local economy. Sink all eight of the invading ships. Keep this oh yeah, keep the sea shadow safe. The sea shadow can actually be destroyed in this mission, which uh, will mean what are you doing, cat? You're gonna have a bad time. Because our sea shadow has now moved. He's going for the banks on Yinbi. We've obviously got his attention. Keep the pressure on, Commander, but watch it. There's a mobile radar to the west. The sea shadow Bloody was cats. in the Don't let her get in harm's way. Right, yes, yeah, so the sea shadow is in the vicinity. Luckily, we have our Harrier, and we're going to chew a motherfucker up. Quite easily, actually. I completely forgot that there was two extra lives in this level. Uh, we will go scoop those up in a minute, when time allows, because I think this mission has a time limit. Oh, alert zone. Oh, bugger. That's not good. I actually can't remember where the alert zone is for this one. I think the alert zone is that little radar boat that we couldn't find last mission. But that's okay. The landing craft fleet is on course for Yinbi Island. Sea Shadow's in the area. Cover her. Alright. Don't you worry about that, my son. We've got this. We've got this. Like shooting fish in a barrel. All LSTs destroyed. Good work, Chief. Not bad, boys. Not bad. That was a slaughter. Look, you're straight like the car. Our homie Wong's feeling the heat. <laughs> Allow a dog to get pleased, Mr. Wong. That is the nature of our business. Wong has backed himself into a corner. When we eliminate all his other options, he'll tell us what we want to know. To be fair, we have pretty much taken his little empire apart piece by piece. Now, missile boats, this is a bastard of a mission. Uh, we do have... I'm pretty sure we've got a time limit on this one. But, I, mm. yeah, let's quickly go and deal with those. Why does the game keep pausing? That's annoying. Yeah, let's go deal with those first. And then we can pick up our Apache. Now, these boats have got something stupid like a thousand armor. Or something. We can pick up mines. Yep, I should hope they know we're coming. Yeah, they've got like a thousand armor each. But that's okay, because we're in this monstrous beast. 
And this thing eats armor for breakfast. Although, we're having our armor eaten for breakfast. Yes! You almighty Harrier. Look at these missile boats. They look like those Aegeus cruisers. Nasty, nasty bits of work. Whoa! Danger close. I think we're going to need some brown... Uh, some fresh brown trousers. After that one. Right, to the bottom with E. To David Jones locker. Now, let's go transfer back over to our chopper. Because this thing is basically Winchestered. She's abused, but she's been used. So now she can rest. There we go. Settle down, my friend. Settle down. Now, we don't actually use these anymore in the UK. Uh, they were retired quite a few years ago, if I remember correctly. Now, let's go scoop up those lives. We don't have any time pressure from this mission anymore because we have uh, sent those ships down to Davy Jones's locker. Best place for them, really, if you ask me. You know. Um, let's go scoop up this life. Now, the next mission... Uh, ha, ha, ha. I'm not looking forward to the next mission. Well, I am. You know, I love this game. Tiki action? Well, yes. Um, yeah, the next mission is bastard hard from what I can remember. But I am actually playing these missions in advance to uh, practice a little bit. Because I is smart, yo. Or at least that's what I'm telling myself. Disclaimer, I may not be that smart. Then they're yeah, old pilots. <laughs> yeah, alright, buddy. Um, there are old pilots and there are bold pilots, but there are no old, bold pilots, apparently. So, we've got plenty of lives now. In fact, we are good to go. I don't think we're going to be coming back up here. So, let's go scoop up that armor whilst we was here. It would be a shame to leave it for the roaches now. Now, if I was a box of uh, smart, self-repairing armor... <laughs> I would be there, I suppose. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Mm -mm -mm. And you know what? We might as well grab the fuel whilst we're here as well. Why the fuck not? Mm -mm. Now let's go have a look for this ammo. I remember it being on Gun Island. But I don't remember where it was. I can't even remember if it just looks like a normal ammo crate. But, for the longest time, I thought it was a cheat that I used to put in as a kid. Because, you know, back then you you had all sorts of cheats for games, and they, they actually enhanced the game. Uh, definitely enhanced the replayability, anyway. But thinking about it, no, there's definitely... was some kind of... enhanced firepower thingy over here. And I'm sure it was on Gun Island. By Odin's mighty beard. Or. Or was it. On, no, it wasn't on that rocky island. Was it like this one? Oh, there's so many ammo containers. I don't really want to just pick up ammo and waste it off. Hang on a minute, I'm going to see if I can find it. One second, guys. We call this the Hornet's Fury. Crushes tanks like soda cans. Fire it from your hydro trigger. Ooh, we got it, guys. It was this one. Nice. Got a thousand rockets now. Now they only do 15 points of damage each, but they do. That's the missiles. Yeah, they do fire uh, a lot of rounds at once. So this is going to be fun. I, I'm quite happy I remembered about that, actually. Nice. All right, we're going to use all of this. I don't remember getting this on another level. I am going to be racking my little brain bone. See if I can actually. Whoa! Holy shit! That sent us reeling. Let's go see if we can snuff out this 
fucking little radar boat. Bastard thing. It really is being a thorn in my ass right now. I do have a feeling though he doesn't spawn until the correct mission. Yes, yes, yes. You know what? Let's bug out for now. I'm fairly sure we have to wait until we're on that mission until the little shit stain appears. That's fine. We'll be ready for the fucker this time. Okay, let's avoid that for now. Whoa, I said avoid that. Not get peppered with rounds. Right, let's have a look at what this Hornet's Fury can do. Crushes tanks. Whoa, holy shit. I don't remember it firing that fast. But okay. So yeah, they're like, uh, almost like a Gatling gun of sorts. Oh, we don't actually have to destroy those. You right there, buddy? Yeah, Scimitar is literally no challenge whatsoever. What about these warriors? Good night, ladies and gentlemen, and good night. Right, let's light this building up. No point wasting anything good on it. There's a lot of ammo, actually. A lot of wingtip reload ammo. I am wondering if that's going to reload our Hornet's weapon. Our Hornet's Fury. But, I don't really want to take the chance. Excellent, Commander. Missile ships are sunk. Well, the missile ships were sunk a little while ago, Milado. So, what's next? Destroy the barracks. Yeah, there we go. See that little, uh, that little square just above the island? That is our radar boat. Huang's infantry is housed and trained in this concrete citadel. Destroy all sentry towers that defend the island. Then neutralize all enemy soldiers. Oi, oi, sir. Looks like a bad kung fu movie down there. Watch yourself, too. There's a radar ship painting the alert zone. <laughs> painting an alert zone, you say? Well, let's go paint him with lead. Or hornets ammo. Every time we get out the, um... The map screen there, we get that radar chug. That radar chug? <laughs> hey, I'm tired, god damn it. Um, that radar lag. Radar lag, game lag. Come on, brain. Radar ship I see it. There we go. She is gone, baby. Okay, now. These turrets here will do m immense amount of damage to us. Maybe this party could use a little pop. Yeah, but lucky for us, Cash can crack these puppies open. Because they have like a thousand armor or something ridiculous. Right, let's go for it. 30 millimeter death for everybody. Oh, I think it's 20 millimeter on an Apache. Yeah, 20 millimeter. Let's light them up. Oh, this is terrible. Ah, oh, the humanity. It's a slaughter down there. Just the way we like it. We are losing armor here. Good work, Cash. Whoa, we're lighting Cash up there. Good thing he's obviously wearing a butt pan from uh, Player Unknown. You guys can keep coming all you like. Hmm, excellent. What the hell is shooting? Oh, hello. Fucking hell. Where do you come from, sunshine? I don't know where you came from, but I know where you're going. To hell. Hey, buddy. Good night, sir. Enjoy your death. I do like that. That's so cool. Alright, shred these targets. It'd be rude not to use them, after all. Come on, Cash. We're burning fuel here. Run, man! Run! You might be the best digger in the trenches, but you're sure as shit, and not the best runner on the track. Come on, buddy. Oh, they actually do shoot him. Uh, I was going to say, Cash, buddy, that butt pan certainly helped you there. Yeah, well, I don't think they're going to need R&R, buddy. I think they're going to need coffins. There's a lot of black letters to send home. Come on, Cash. Cash. I, I could probably pick you up from there, buddy. Buddy. Cash. It's it's okay. It's okay. You can stop running now. 
<sighs> you obviously can't hear me with all that lead in his ears. Let's ride. We need some go juice and we need some armor. There was armor on this. There we go. Yeah, so I spent all that time trying to find the bloody. Uh, that bloody ship. And it doesn't spawn until the level start or until the mission starts. That's frustrating. Whoa, hello. I don't know why I'm freaking out about a little man with an AK. Jesus. <laughs> Fish in a barrel. I've forgotten how much fun. Oh. <laughs> Look at the little technical. Oh, he's so adorable, man. Well, there's a 20,000 pound truck up in smokes. Okay, military base is next, you say. Capture Huang's brother and destroy the depot. Vehicles, uh, depot vehicles. Destroy all black market scimitar and warrior vehicles. Capture Huang's brother to discover the location of Huang. Caution, this uh, uh, island is protected by a hilltop radar. I think if I remember correctly, which I may or may not do, we destroyed that radar. Why charge when you can use cash? Drop them next to the scimitars and watch them go. Mm-hmm. Then that is what we shall do. Or, you know, we could just use our Hornet's Fury. Because this thing is ridiculous. I remember it being like rockets. Not like a, a dual Gatling gun setup. But still, I can't remember if the manual actually references that weapon. I might dig it out in a minute and have a look. Have a little look, see what we can find. You're right there, fella. Yeah, fuck now, lad. Drop me here, mate. I'll do it my way. Yeah, you do them your way, pal. Go have some fun. All work, no play makes uh, Nick a dull lad. All right, we can light up the buildings. You can light up the vehicles. We we'll punch the hole. He can scoop the meat. Ah, oh, thus ends the fun. Now I don't know if I pick up ammo. Is it going to override my rockets? Probably. So let's not do that then. Nick, you're taking for ages. God damn it! Oh, we're bingo fuel too. That's fine. Man. I wonder if there's a cheat to actually use those rockets. See, that's how I thought you got them. I, I didn't realize they were a legitimate pickup. That's blown my... Why do I keep calling him Nick as well? It's called Harding Cash. Warning, low fuel. And there's this little shit stain. You're mine now, Milado. Right, we need go juice. Lissai. Of course, the go juice is about a thousand miles away. Okay. I guess brotherly love is overrated. We've got Wong's location. He's in a bogus oil rig to the southwest. Commander, Wong probably knows we're on to him. Expect an extremely warm welcome. Who? I hope so. I'd be disappointing if there were, uh, disappointing. I'd be disappointed if there wasn't a warm reception. Okay, we completely bugged out there and changed direction. That would be okay. Good night, if we weren't so perilously close to ditching this thing in the dirt. There we go. Lovely. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see. Little Gatling guns. That's adorable. Have some hornets. You're done. You're done. You are also done. Oh, we're almost out of rounds. Yes, this thing is too good. You're gone as well. Who's left? Just you. There we go. Vaporized. Whoa, shit. Evening, sunshine. Good night, sir. Oh, that's just that. Yeah, this guy's going to shoot at us, but... Oh, well. Pretty sure there's nothing we can do. 
None of our weapons will actually crack this uh, this guy. We're just going to have to tail him for now. Fuck you, buddy. Ah, I didn't lock. I can't remember how we do that lock-on thing now. I know it's a combination of buttons. We've literally just used all of our wingtips. This is unacceptable. Oh, shit. Chopper. Ace is high, motherfucker. You're done. Come here, you little turd. I gotcha. Boom, baby. Yeah, there's some very bad mixing in this game. Like, I have no idea what he just said. Wong self-destructed. Well, we are out of rockets. Or at least we're out of the good rockets. Still, we can have some fun here. And it sounds like the sound has glitched. There we go. Okay, that was weird. Just unlimited uh, machine guns. Which sounds fun. Right, you're not allowed to have this hardware, guys. This is property of the queen. Which means... It needs to be... Ah, destroyed. And all these stinking, filthy pirates. Owning this kind of hardware. Right, let's go scoop up some more go juice and return with a full load of ammo. Alright, let's bug out. And that, my friends, is basically this mission finished. Oh, we didn't even read this, I don't think. Capture Huang on his fortified oil rig. Huang is hiding on an oil platform that has been converted into a formidable fortress. Flush Huang out and capture him. Remember, Commander, we want Huang alive. Yeah, yeah. Before you go knocking, there's a small island in the northwest that can provide you a calling card. Could provide you a what? Remember, Commander, we want Huang alive. Before you go knocking, there's a small island in the northwest that could provide you a calling card. Provide you something? Yeah, the audio mixing in this game is actually terrible. I didn't realize it was that bad, but never mind. Anyway, our mission is complete. Let's go get our asses down. Wow, is that 23 minutes? Fucking hell. We totally rinsed that one. Or well, that half, I should say. Maybe I should have done this in one take. Well, we're at the edge of the map, yo. We need to go north. Enjoy your, your beach time activities, my friend. Sorry for rinsing your uh, huts. Okay, man. Oh, hang on, before we... Oh, fuck. Hello. Yeah, I am escaping. What are you going to do about it? Fuck all. That's what you're going to do about it. Escaping my ass. We are drowning. No, we we wanna we wanna land. Can we can, can we land? Look look. Okay, pick up the ammo. That's fine. Now can we land? There we go. That was just greedy. The tropical serenity of the China Sea was shattered today by the eruption of Mount Palawan. Flaming debris has covered several islands of the Labu Royal chain. Strike net vectors have Lamar heading for North Korea. Just in time for Kim's peace conference. Yeah, uh -oh. target rich environment for a terrorist. So we have Lamond and his nuke. And here's a city full of pollock chickens. Pollock chickens. <laughs> this guy's good. Hmm. This next level. Oh dear, this next level. <sighs> Countdown. This level is where this game gets its name from. And we have the worst vehicle in the game. Eh, maybe the hovercraft's worse. Nah, the hovercraft can at least defend itself. This next mission... I always hated this mission. Well, the mission itself's good, but the vehicle we're in... 
Well, you'll see. And we can just enjoy this music. I'd forgotten how good this music is until I played it again. Oh, I'd love a HD remake of these games. It's never going to happen. Never going to happen. It's so good. Again, it makes me think back to how excited I used to be about the future of gaming when I was a kid. And just like how badass the PlayStation era of games was. And then the PlayStation 2 and original Xbox. And then we got to like the 360 and, and towards like the end of the 360's life. I'd say even, you know, halfway through the 360's life. Gaming just seemed to start taking a turn to this kind of slurry cesspit that we're in now whereas gaming just just ain't what it used to be it's just it's at the risk of sounding old I'm only 32 I don't know I'm just not as excited about gaming as I used to be I mean I can still go back and play all, all these old games like every year it just seems to be less and less games I'm interested in coming out. But we've still got these old classics. And that's not to say good games aren't still coming out. They are. It just, just ain't what it used to be, guys. Ah, oh, listen to it. Maybe I'm just jaded. I could be. Ah. This music always makes me so happy. Music's such an interesting medium. Nothing else can transport you back in time or completely change your emotional state like music. Oh, yeah, apart from hard drugs, of course. But I wouldn't recommend those. Anyway, guys, before I go off on a, a, a sleep deprivation induced coma or something, uh, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching and I'll get this video rendered and hopefully up today because I really don't want to miss two videos this week. So thanks for watching guys and as always, until next time.